My next guest is one of the stars of the new Coneheads movie. It opens this Friday. He's also going into his fourth season on Saturday Night Live. Here's a quick look at one of his characters, motivational speaker Matt Foley. Take a look. Well, as I see it, there is only one solution. And that is for me to get my gear, move it on in here, because I'm going to bunk with you, buddy. We're going to be buddies. We're going to be pals. We're going to wrestle around. <laughs> Old Matt's gonna be your shadow. Here's you, here's Matt. There's you, there. hard to believe this is your first time on a talk show. You know? yeah. A little yeah. nervous tonight, are you? Yes, sir, yeah. definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Scared. I'm glad, glad I'm doing it with you. Yeah, well, good, good to have you here. <laughs> Thanks, Jay. Oh, it's good to see you. It's good to see you. I always enjoy your work. Yeah. Now, let me ask you about, uh, let me ask you about that character we just saw, the Matt Foley guy, the motivational speaker. Yeah. Now, did they write that? Did you come up with that character? Is it one of your own? Uh... Actually, I did it at Second City. Bob Odenkirk uh, wrote that for me. It's, uh, but it's a little bit of my dad, you know, he, um, <laughs> yeah. he uh, it's a lot of bit of my dad. He used to start out slow and then build to a rage. He'd go like, uh, I thought I told you boys to shovel the rock! Get out there! <laughs> Now, where, where did you grow up that a walk would require shoveling? I'm, I'm curious, where about you from? Ah, uh, from Madison, Wisconsin. Oh, okay, that's nice. Yeah. Good kid, troublemaker, what, what were you like? Uh, I, I guess I was, um, I got in a lot of trouble at school. The, I remember that one time the nuns were all around me and my mom and they're in the middle. And they said, <laughs> Miss, Mrs. Farley, the students at school are laughing at Christopher, not with him. <laughs> <laughs> so there. Uh, yeah, Aww. thanks. Thanks, you guys. Well, it must have been tough going to Catholic school. Hyperactive kid, were you? Were you just... Yeah, I was a little hyperactive. Uh... Good to see that's gone away anyway. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so when, how did you get started in comedy coming out? Did you do stand-up first? Because most of the guys in Saturday Night Live were stand-ups at one point. Did you ever do just straight stand-up, tell jokes? I tried stand-up, but I never could. Uh, it's too dumb to come up with my own material, so I just thought <laughs> I try to play off the audience, but that didn't work too much. It's usually just a staring contest. I try to like, you know, get them going or something like that and go, what'd you say? <laughs> Nothing, we're just waiting for your act, Tubby. And uh, yeah, that, can be, that can be rough. So yeah. I like working with an ensemble, you yeah. know, and, and working off other Why people's things. You do a great job now. When you, when you first came to New York from Madison, was that, uh, was that uh, tricky to get used to? I mean, it's, Oh it's yeah, New York, that was a scary, coming from the Midwest. Yeah. At first, I thought, what's going on out there? <laughs> first, I thought I'd come on there all cocky, like, I'm going to bring this down to its knees. <laughs> and then by about a month, I was like, yeah, I go home. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Now I like it a lot. It's excellent. Oh, you fit right in there now? You, yeah. yeah, pretty much. It's, you know, me and Lauren. I, I love Lauren. Yeah. We hang out together. We go rollerblading in Central Park together. Oh, really? So. Yeah, big rollerblading? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. No, but I love Lauren. He's the greatest. He, well, how about I'm L.A. Saying. when you come here? Is this, is this a, an odd uh, place for you to be? Is it... Yeah, I love it out here, too. It's excellent. You it's um... pretty much like it everywhere, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> I go up uh, to my manager, Mark Gervitz's place up in Malibu. and uh, Up in Malibu, yeah. Yeah, he lives up there with uh, John Lovitz. He came home one day, and me and John Lovitz were uh, playing in the, in the ocean, and uh, he said he came home, and it looked like, looked like Free Willy out there. <laughs> Now you're doing what, Wayne's World 2? Yeah, I'm doing Wayne's World 2 and Airheads. Because I saw you in, in the one, and Airheads. You do a lot of movies that have heads in them, cone heads, airheads. So Wayne's yeah. World 2, now you were the, what, the security guy in the first one? Yeah, yeah the yeah. security guard. Well, that was kind of 
That was a scary experience. Is that your first movie? Yeah, that was my first movie. I well, screwed up, too, at one point. What'd you do? What'd you... And they told me to point into the camera when I was, um, when I was uh, given directions. You go yeah. through St. Louis, back down through Chicago on your way to Detroit. And I pointed off the wrong way, and I had to, like, scoot it back into the camera frame. But they kept it. It was genius. I don't know why. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs>